Now in this video, we're gonna talk about how to find the average rate of change from a graph. So we're given this graph here that's modeling the population after a certain amount of years. And they're asking what is the average rate of change from year two to year six. So what they want is the average rate of change from year two to year six. So between these two points, and if we draw a line between them, this is the secant line. Basically, to find the average rate of change, we have to find the slope of this secant line. So this is the secant line. And at year two, what is the population? What is the coordinate? What's the y value of this coordinate? Well, it's 30. So at year two, the population is 30. And then here, at year six, the population is 100. So average rate of change, if you remember, the formula is delta y over delta x, how much the dependent variable changes over how much the independent variable changes. So it's basically gonna be the difference in the y value, so y2 minus y1, so 100 minus 30, over the difference in the independent variables, the time, so x2 minus x1, six minus two. So this is 70 over four, and this would give us 17 and a half, whatever the population is in. So let's say the population is people. I should have wrote this before. So 17 and a half people per one uh, unit uh, change in the independent variable per year. So in conclusion, between years two and six, on average, the population is increasing at 17 and a half people per year.